Let's begin today's Yu-Gi-Oh news with my all-time favorite archetype and the game that isn't a waifu deck finally getting new support in Rage of the Abyss. Because Cardfight Vanguard is in its glorified Skullidol culture season and I need something to boost my channel's ad revenue. Anarchist Monk of the Six Samurai is a tuna monster that you can only use the effects with the same name once per turn. You can special summon this card from your hand. If you control another 6 samurai monster, that isn't another copy of himself. You can add up to one 6 samurai quick play spell card from your deck. If this card is sent from the field to the graveyard, and it gives a 6 samurai monster synchro summoned with this card as material in effect, that reduces the levels of all the monsters your opponent controls by one. After so many years, Kizan and Grandmaster aren't the only ones you can use to start flooding the field as well as a tutor card that doesn't make you rely on Bushido counters. I'm out of the loop, so I'm not sure how disruptive lowering your opponent's monster's level, but it's a nice perk. Instructor of the Six Samurai is a tuna monster that you can only use the effects with the same name once per turn. You can special summon this card from your hand. If you control another Six Samurai monster, that isn't another copy of himself. You can add up to one six strike card from your deck. If this card is sent from the field to the graveyard, and it gives a six samurai monster synchro summoned with this card as material in effect, that reduces 500 attack from your opponent's monsters. Kageki's life has been rough. From losing his limbs, to becoming a chamberlain, and now shrinking as he ages. And I never thought I'd see the day that six strike triple impact or six strike thunder blast can finally be used consistently. Legendary Clasher 6 Samurai Shien is a synchro monster that needs one warrior tuna monster and one or more non-tuna 6 samurai monster to be synchro summoned. When he's synchro summoned, you can add up to one 6 samurai or Shien monster from your deck or graveyard. Once per turn you can negate the activation of a opponent's monster effect and destroy it. And you can destroy another of your monster instead if this card on the field would be destroyed. Holy Shien. Six Samurai finally has a level 6 monster which the archetype ironically didn't have besides Chancellor Enishi. On top of Shien finally working like most modern Yu-Gi-Oh cards of having the ability of getting a card after being summoned. He can also negate monster effects now. And it only took 13 years and all he had to do was become even more corrupted in case you didn't know what Clasher means. Legendary Clasher 6 Samurai Enishi is a synchro monster that needs one warrior tuna monster and one or more non-tuna monster to be synchro summoned and can only use the first and third effects with the same name once per turn. When he's synchro summoned, you can banish any number of 6 samurai monsters in your graveyard to return the same amount of your opponent's monsters to their hand. During the battle phase, he gives your warrior type monsters 500 attack and defense. And when he's sent to the graveyard, you can special summon one 6 samurai monster in your banish zone. The one thing I hate in Yu-Gi-Oh besides the it being a dice game, is using effects with a big cost that can easily be shut down by one hand trap negate effect. I would rather use a level 4 Enish's effect over this, since that could at least be used to response to a quick effect. The attack and defense increase as well as the free banish revive however is a welcomed addition. Finally, 6 strike double assault is a quick play spell card that you can only use one of each effects with the same name once per turn. When activated, either special summon one 6 samurai monster with 2000 or less attack from your hand or graveyard, or put one of your opponent's monsters into face down defense position. You can do both if you control two or more 6 samurai monsters. And during your main phase, you can banish this card from your graveyard to add a 6 samurai monster in your graveyard to your hand. With this card, all of the original legendary 6 samurai are finally featured in 6 strike cards. The archetype can finally revive a 6 samurai without needing to wait a turn by setting return of the 6 samurai, double edged sword technique, or even ultimate last stand. And being able to banish this card and getting a 6 samurai monster back is just icing on the cake. Overall I really like these new cards. They finally fix some of the deck's issues of relying too much on other cards like Gateway of the 6 or 6 Samurai United to get card advantage. If I had one issue, this is more likely to just supplement the deck's current playstyle of setting up turn 1 end boards the game has been infamous for. And that concludes this Yu-Gi-Oh news without the bullshit. Special thanks to my Patreon members for continuing to support my content creation. 
Be sure to subscribe and let me know in the comments how there's only 4 new 6 samurai monsters and we should get 2 more.